feel, feels great. Um, always. I know these guys. I mean, I've known these guys for 35 years, but 40 yeah. years maybe. Probably, yeah. Actually, probably more than that. Probably 40. Yeah. yeah. At least. Yeah. Yeah. It feels great. I mean, I always love coming back here and playing, you know, my home state. It feels great. Um, wish I could have played a little better today. Kind of clanked it around, but, you know, Salvage got it under par, so hopefully a little better tomorrow. How much did the birdie on 18 help kind of Yeah, leave that, you was with nice. a good that was nice. That was nice. I three putted uh, seven and eight. So, uh, you know, that was unfortunate, but um, really rolled it nicely all day, actually. So, you know, kind of a bummer. They were long range putts, but, you know, still got to hit it a little better, though. That's, that's the thing. And I know I can, so hopefully, hopefully that'll happen tomorrow. Who's your caddy and how hard is it to get a caddy for a one off for a week, you know? Uh, it's actually pretty, a little easier than you think. Okay. Um, the caddy that's caddying for me is Kyle Kalenda. He, he usually caddies for Kent Jones. Uh, Jonesy didn't quite get in. I think he was like first or second alternate, maybe third alternate, okay. something like that. So, uh, you know, Kyle kind of took over for me this week. You've only played in so. one competitive tournament this year, Florida Senior? Yeah. Um, yeah. So. Well, actually, I played the tour event in Puerto Rico. But that okay. was, that was a, I found out Wednesday afternoon and <laughs> flew there and just played a couple rounds. <laughs> that was about it. <laughs> so, uh, but anyway, that was fun, though. But, yeah, really the, you know, Florida Senior Open was really the competitive, you know, tournament that I played in. So. How, how tough is it, you know, when you haven't really played to come out here and compete with these guys on the stage? Um, yeah, I mean, it's not easy. I mean, you know, you just haven't played that many competitive rounds. I mean, I, you know, I was talking to, you know, a friend of mine, and I just said, you know what, I've done this enough. It's not that big a deal. I mean, it's, you know, riding that bike, you know, the old saying, you know, just got to get right back up on that horse and, mm -hmm. you know, get her going. I mean, I, I felt comfortable out there today. I just I just didn't hit it as well as I would have liked to with the irons. I drove it fine, but, you know, need to hit it a little better, you know, with the irons and the greens and give myself, you know, a few better opportunities, a few better looks. Are you, are you still teaching in Florida? Is that? I am, yes. How's that going? It's going great. Yeah, the coaching side is going really well. I have some really nice players. I uh, really enjoy it. I'm home a little bit more, although I feel like playing a little bit. So, you know, I'd like to get get out here just a little bit more than I am. On the course, do you find yourself thinking as a coach or more as a, as a golfer? Does it, or has no, that as changed? a player, like that'll any... never change. I mean, I think the one thing about coaching is that it, it reaffirms what kind of you should be doing. So, in a way, it helps my game, I think. Um, you know, you just, you know, it, it's kind of a, you know, you know, do as I say, you know, kind of deal. I mean, it's, you know, it's what I'm teaching, so I better abide by that. Yeah. <laughs> do you still draw a gallery out here that knows your connection to the state? Uh, you know, not as much as I would probably if it was in Milwaukee, mm -hmm. I think, you know, because I'm from Milwaukee. So Madison, this is almost like a different state for me. <laughs> Although I'm, you know, I'm in the same state. It feels great to me, don't get me wrong, mm -hmm. but, you know, I think this is Steve and Jerry land. <laughs> <laughs> <You know? laughs> 